welcome to Ayo on Evo Entertainment. Oh my god, guys, we're super excited today because we're going to be telling you guys what we've learned about Somalia. Guys, okay, so we've been receiving a lot of comments, you know, from our Somali family, and we figured why why not you know tell the world what we have learned about Somalia so far because when we search the internet guys a lot of negativity about this beautiful country and you know Ayo and Ebo we are known for spreading positive vibes about Africa shedding positive light and we want to share this positive the ray of positivity that Ayo and Ebo embodies we want to share it on this amazing country Somalia so we're gonna be you know telling you guys and telling the world especially so you guys share this video like this video let it reach the end of the earth as we'll be telling people teaching people about Somalia guys also you can support our gofundme which is spreading positive vibes about, about africa. africa support our project on gofundme yes the link is in the description box below yep so <laughs> yeah one of the first things i learned is that this beautiful country that is on the horn of africa is along the coast line yeah, it has the longest coastline i'm telling you the longest coastline by the indian ocean and it has um how many countries um i think there's ethiopia kenya, kenya and, and djibouti, djibouti surrounding it yeah those are amazing neighbors. amazing i and can't imagine how blue the country is gonna be maybe that's why they have the flag the flag is blue and with the five star crescent yeah so it's a beautiful flag i really don't know the inspiration but i'm thinking it's from the sea possibly yeah but you guys you can tell us more this is what we're learning we learned and we don't want to give any wrong information so you guys are our co-helpers so in the comment section below you can always you know give us more, more information. information what did i learn i learned that the population is 15 million people wow that's a lot that is a yeah, whole lot lots, of people yeah. Wow, and I, I know they're distributed in different places. Like the capital is Mogadishu. Yeah, I know, I know Bos Bosaso and Marika and um, Hargesa. Hargesa, yes, 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 yes. Which other one? I think basically. And Kismayo. Yeah, I think these are their major cities, the cities. that are like populated. Exactly, yeah. Somali people. They're so from what we read they're so the culture is amazing 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 and their president is uh president mohammed abdullahi mohammed yeah i think he was inaugurated in 2017 on february 19 or something like that maybe 17 18 19 i'm not sure which of the dates but it was around february mm -hmm. and that was when he was inaugurated and they they have like a prime minister and a president okay yeah yeah they have but which one is really leading like you know in some countries yeah minister that is well, has more power than the president true true I, I really don't know I really don't know um, of course the the export bananas yeah I know Somali people love bananas so much people were saying that like the favorite fruit of Somalia is bananas exactly so <laughs> and that Somali people eat bananas with like almost everything the most shocking thing I learned is that Somalia has uranium Really? iron ore um they have oil like they've not yet natural gas natural gas they have awesome natural like ah, bauxite too i think they have, they have bauxite and copper they have copper as well i'm like wow. it's a rich nation rich in a lot Actually, of resources africa is really blessed africa is really really blessed with a lot of natural resources beautiful people diverse culture it's just the most amazing continent like it's it's just beautiful honestly and really needs to be explored um we pray for more peace we pray for more unity in africa and you know more blessings upon our brothers and our sisters yes okay well actually there is a mistake a lot of people make okay. which i've also made okay. for the demonyms of somali people like several times people say people from somalia are called somalians hmm. but actually people from somalia are called somali that's very very true so that is like, you guys keep that in mind people from somalia some <laughs> people from somalia 
are called Somali. Somali. Yeah. And actually, I don't know the conversion rate presently, but of course, ah. when we go to Somalia, we're going to be spending Somali shillings. <laughs> Woo! Yes, 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 yes. And the official languages are Somali, Somali and, and Arabic. Arabic. And the foreign languages um, are English, English and, and Italian. Italian. So it means that an average Somali is, yeah, is really bilingual. bilingual. Exactly. But actually, I feel an average African is bilingual or multilingual because usually an average African speaks the official language of the, and the country. Local language. Very true. Very, and very true. That makes us really talented, you know, because knowing one or more languages, that is. A talent. It really shows um, how intelligent one is, how much it can grasp. You know, this is the brain, and you can think in multiple languages and not get crazy. <laughs> <laughs> and I know they love bananas so much, but I was reading that their national animal is leopard. Oh, on the coat of arms. Mm -hmm. That's very, very true. You know, it has the something like a crown that it's. The Somali flag and then two leopards are like standing. It looks like a beautiful coat of arms. I'm not sure why the leopard was chosen. Yeah. I, I need to read about the the character. Probably is the characteristics of the leopard that really that really connects with the country. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. More Somali writers should come up and you know fill the the web, the Wikipedia, the internet with positive you know write-ups about Somali yeah, we, because we need to read more amazing things than what is just already there's there there's so much negativity about not just Somalia but about Africa. Africa like that's why we are always trying to break stereotypes about Africa because when you check the internet about Africa it's just always it's about war, war um, starvation Asia, poverty, poverty oh don't disease. go here they have this disease don't talk to these people they have that um, disease or something like that yeah. it's always illness poverty war and Africa is really really beautiful there's a lot of things to explore in Africa and we are the ones that can do this when we say we not just Ayo and Ebo but Ayo and Ebo family we africans should be the ones telling our stories and spreading this positive vibes about africa we should not leave the stories to others to tell because we as africans live in africa and we know how africa is so we should be the ones to spread the positive lights to others exactly so what else what else what else did hmm. we learn actually you know the thing that I want to say, it's not a bad thing not to know something, but it's, Very true. it's really wrong if you don't want to learn. Ignorance is, is a disease. So if you don't know something, at least Google it, ask someone, don't yeah. just say, oh, I don't know it, so I don't care to know. And actually, another thing is the food, Somali food. I think one of our, some, some comments were talking about janjera, janjera, mm. that okay. it's like Somali pancake, something like that. Okay. And also the religion. Oh yeah, basically people from Somali practice um, Islam. I know there will be more and more on the internet, like Somali cultural dress and other things. Somali language, yeah. We did a language. Yeah, so we did the language challenge. So guys, check out that video and share it with your friends we'll here. <laughs> and your frenemies, not just your friends <laughs> and your frenemies as well. <laughs> Yeah, so we're learning the Somali language. So any other thing you think we should know, learn about, you know, this is what we have learned so far on our own. So we have a whole lot more to learn, we know, and we are open to learning, we're receptive to learning. So and guys, to also use our channel and our media platform to teach others to about your country. Comment below things you want people to know about your country, Somalia, and other African countries. Yeah. So guys, that's what we have for you this week. We love you guys so much. Have a great week, friends, and... Peace out. And subscribe, subscribe below. below. <laughs>